In the midst of a competitive cheerleading season, a distressing incident unfolded involving a young cheerleader, Ryan Brunson, and the Maryland Twisters team. The catalyst for this controversy was a dispute surrounding Ryan's hairstyle, which had been carefully replicated from an approved style provided by the team itself. The issue arose when the coach attempted to fashion Ryan's hair into a high ponytail, deviating from her natural shoulder length, curly hair. Despite the similarity between Ryan's hairstyle and the ones endorsed by the team, management insisted that her hair, being thicker and longer than her peers, needed to conform to a specific high ponytail standard. This discrepancy led Ryan's mother, Warridge, to voice her concerns through an email to the team's management. In response, the team leader expressed that while Ryan's photos might resemble the other girls' hairstyles, her in-person appearance revealed substantially more hair length due to its uniform length compared to the layered cuts of her teammates. Consequently, the management's directive was for Ryan to style her hair into a high ponytail, a decision that left Warridge dissatisfied and feeling that her daughter was unfairly targeted due to her natural hair texture and volume. This clash of perspectives culminated in Ryan's expulsion from the Maryland Twisters team, as the team deemed their values to be incongruent with those of Warridge and her daughter. A saddened and confused Ryan found herself abruptly removed from an activity she had devoted significant time and energy to, leaving her questioning the reason for her dismissal. Following this incident, Warridge took to social media to share their story, sparking a viral conversation. Numerous African-American mothers and cheerleaders resonated with their experience, highlighting similar discriminatory encounters within the cheerleading community. In response to the escalating situation, the Maryland Twisters issued a statement addressing the allegations of racial bias, asserting their commitment to inclusivity and diversity within their organization. They emphasized their history of fostering an inclusive environment and supporting athletes of all backgrounds, including offering gender-neutral uniform options and implementing hair policies that cater to diverse racial backgrounds. Despite attempts at communication between DC News Now and the Maryland Twisters, there was no immediate response from the team regarding further clarification on the matter. Woolridge fervently hopes that this unfortunate incident will prompt cheerleading organizations to reflect on their treatment of young athletes, urging a re-evaluation of standards that may inadvertently marginalize participants based on their appearance. Her aspiration is for cheerleading communities to prioritize inclusivity and create a supportive space where all participants, irrespective of their appearance, feel valued and respected.